Hi guys, Captain Fructose here and welcome back to Cities Skylines. So last time we started building a theme park here and we worked on uh, the balloon part and it's still level one though. I think we're getting close to level two. It's getting very, very close to level two. We're not quite there yet, but we're getting very, very close. So, in the last episode, I actually asked you guys to uh, post some comments and give me ideas for what we should name this theme park instead of Cozy World, which sounds kind of creepy. And you guys came through and you gave me some suggestions. So, we have several comments. MP Plays it said it should be Laurel Square Amusement Park of Fructose. CWM Gay Plays said, well, he gave me a suggestion. He thinks we should put a subway station next to the amusement park and that would improve things. So that is actually a good idea. We may actually end up doing that in this episode. I'm just trying to get people to these parks so we can get them leveled up. PFC Paris commented Fructose Land, which I do like that one. Showman Plays Fortnite suggested it. We name it Fructopia. Dabbing Spring Bonnie said Captain Fructose Amusement Park and Briandre also agreed that Fructopia would be a cool name. So we actually have two people suggesting that one. So I think we are going to go with Fructopia, but thanks everybody who commented and suggested names. You guys are freaking awesome. We are gonna go with Fructopia. We're going with that though. That's what it's called now. So welcome to the land of Fructopia, Chirpy Land. Why is that called Chirpy Land? Amusement park, main gate. Can I change it from Chirpy Land? Cause I don't like that. I want to change the name. Can I not do that? Okay, we'll pretend that doesn't exist. What's our level at? Okay, so we're getting pretty close. Let's see, total visitors until next level. So yeah, so we've only got about 100 and what? 173 visitors left for this one, for this levels up. What about Balloon Park? I feel like we're a lot closer with Balloon Park. Oh, well we can look at both of them right here. Oh yeah, Balloon Park only needs like 104 more people to visit before it levels up. So we're very, very close. Um, so I am actually going to take uh, CWM gameplay suggestion and we're going to attach this to the subway system. That is not the subway system. <laughs> Where's my subway system? Tram subway station. Subway station. All right, um, I should probably connect it. Actually, let's add, I like that idea so much, we're gonna add one over by this park as well because we've got space over here, so. Wait, is that the main entrance? Oh no, the main entrance is over here, but I can't put it there because the rocket launch pad's in the way. So, we'll put this right here by the side gate. We don't even have the subway go over that way. I'm gonna put in another one right now, because why not? Oh, quit your complaining, you big babies. You are all big babies. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and um, build the rail lines to connect this up to the rest of the subway system. Right, so now that we've got the lines in, or the, uh, the rails, the tracks, whatever you wanna call them, we do need to put in a new line. So let me go ahead and put in the new line. Okay, so there's our new subway line. I made it go clear out through the city there. So, hopefully, that new uh, subway line should bring people into town. I thought that there was a way to connect the trains to the subway, but maybe I was mistaken because I am not seeing it. What is this? Oh my gosh, that is so cool! I didn't even know I could do that. Oh, that looks so much nicer than that bridge. <gasps> I'm gonna do it at now. Oh my gosh, that looks so pretty. Oh, I love that. Wait, wait, can I do that with the roads? Please say yes. No, why not? That is so pretty though, I love that. Oh my gosh. I bet you there's a mod to do it. I'm gonna have to look for that. I'm gonna have to see if I can find a mod to do it. So that just looks, it just looks so much nicer than that bridge that was there. The whole thing just looks so pretty. And I can't do anything to that one. Oh, I love that. Okay, I will stop ogling my new bridge for a little bit anyway. Okay, so we've got the new subway line in. Wait, what the? 
Oh, that's the tour buses. We put some tour buses in, didn't we? Yes, we sure did. 20 per week. Tourists. Sightseeing bus. <clears throat> oh, we did put in the sightseeing bus depot. It is right there. Okay. So, what's this? Walking tour point of interest. Oh, you know what? We haven't put in any hiking trails or anything like that either. So, that might be a good thing. Um, I'm actually going to put in... I think we should put in another sightseeing bus line. So, I think I'm going to do that. Okay, so I've completed that bus line. I basically just took it around to some of the most... Or some of the um, touristy areas that didn't have a tour bus going to them. So, that's basically all I did with that line. And, of course, I ran it over here to the amusement park, which... The amusement park was definitely happy about as soon as I put it there. So, taxis. We do have these cable cars. What else do I have? Monorail, ferry, and bus exchange stop. All right. And then we got the rail lines, the subway lines, and to the tram lines, which we don't really have much in the way of trams. They kind of block the flow of traffic, so don't use them a ton. But, yeah. So, this is the uh, tourist... Stop. Woof. Hello. I cannot read the sign, but this is where this new bus line should be going to. What's that? Name? Nope, those are birds. Ooh. Apparently I can jump over the fence. So we're gonna just kind of run along here. Oh, or up there. Chirpy land. Welcome to Chirpy Land. Nope, this is Fruitopia. Thank you very much. Got some games and stuff over here. Robin Hood's running around. Uh, Mr. Meeseeks. Oh, wait. Sorry, wrong person. I think that's Chirpy. So, it's getting there. It is getting there. Okay, so... Where are we at? We are super close. So, Fruitopia and Balloon Park should be leveling up here any minute now. They just need literally a few more visitors, and that is it. Which they should be getting very quickly, because a bunch of people just showed up. <gasps> we just leveled up! Okay, Fruitopia has just leveled up. Okay, so that means we can add more stuff. Uh, if I could remember where the thing was. Okay, so that means we have now unlocked... Uh, we already have the carousel. We've unlocked the piggy train. Okay. So, the piggy train will grow in right there. And then we've got these spinning teacups, which I think we'll throw in just right here. I think that'll be good. Swinging boat. So, we need to level up to level three to unlock the swinging boat and stuff. So, all of the fun big rides, it's going to be a minute before we get those. Coin game. Oh, those things are terrible. I've played those at, like, arcades and stuff. And they just make you want to put more and more money in. And you just lose it. And you don't ever get it back, even in tickets. Well, I guess some people do. I'm not the one that ever gets them, though. So, so we got the spinning teacups, and we got this piggy ride. Oh, goodness. Okay, well, that's that's for little kids, I guess, because that's not super exciting, right? Right. Okay. Well, I mean, that's good. Are these even carrying anybody? I don't know. I can't tell. There's a lot of people coming to the park, though. I think that subway station is helping. Park areas overview. Oh, yeah. Fruitopia has gotten a lot more visitors real fast. So apparently there's just a lot of people wanting to come to the theme park instead of just the city park. The big city park that I was building. Because this place is getting a ton of people very, very quickly. Income 672. So this is actually covering its expenses. Which is like the first park I've built that is actually covering its own expenses. And it's giving me a little bit of income. Which is surprising. Alright, so we're good on entertainment, because the entertainment level's good. Alright, so Fruitopia has gotten bigger and we've built some new rides, which is awesome. Balloon Park, it's a little slower. We haven't got quite as many people visiting Balloon Park, apparently. Unfortunately. We just need one more visitor. One more person, please come visit my park. Just so we can level it up. Pretty please? Whoa, where are all those people going? That is a lot of tourists. Oh! Balloon Park just leveled up. Okay. So, we can build... Alright, so let's work on Balloon Park here. Just a regular park. So, we have unlocked some of this stuff. Park Pier. Park Chess Board. So, let's put in the Park Chess Board. 
All right. Oh, it's got four chess boards. Sweet. Okay. So we've got that. The piers, on the other hand, I don't think I can use those because there's no water. Shoreline required. Yeah, there's no water. That's. I want to know who the freak is eating all of my food in my emergency shelters. Can we build some more fancy stuff? Like, I built a lot of touristy stuff. What other touristy stuff can I build? What's this? City Arch. Oh, that's not very big. Oh, it goes... Oh! Oh! It goes over the road? Oh, that's so cool, though! I like that. That is really cool. Where could I put it, though? That's the question. I don't know. What if we do it here? I don't know why I decided to put it there, but I did. Which way does it face to show the city name? Either way, it doesn't matter. Okay. So there's that. That'll be the entrance to Park Row or something. I don't know. Clock tower. Ooh. We could put in a nice clock tower. Let's throw that right there. And a disaster memorial tax office. Because why not? Bloop. Observatory. I feel like I need to build that on top of a hill, though. Business park. Put in just touristy stuff here. Like, that arch will be for this touristy stuff. I think. Pyramid of safety. Like, this will be like, I don't know, like Las Vegas, Nevada or something, where all the stuff's right there on the strip. I don't know. That's kind of what I was thinking. Wow, I've unlocked a lot of stuff, though. I didn't even realize I'd unlocked this much stuff. Okay, well, we need a disaster memorial because, I mean, we need to remember the disasters that have happened to our city, right? Right. Why not? We want to remember those. Walking tours. Wait, so can I put these? Oh, I could put the walking tours anywhere? I'm going to put in some walking tours because why not? I mean, you could take the bus here. So we're going to create a new walking tour. All right, so that's kind of a long walking tour, and I think it might be kind of hinky right in here. I don't know. So there's that walking tour, but... That's the good thing about having all of these really close right here, is we can put in another walking tour right here that starts, like, right here. And then we can just kind of, like, bloop, stop at each of these, you know, fancy monument-type things. And then to this park, you know. Um, we're not going to make them walk all the way to the amusement park, I don't think. And then we'll have them come across the street to there, and then over to this one. And then... Ooh, I need to add a cross, like a bridge. Ooh! Ooh! This! Okay. Alright. Hold on. Hold on. We're not putting this line in yet. Hold on just a second. We're gonna go ahead and delete this line real quick. I'm having all sorts of ideas. Okay. So, this is what I did. Whoops. Wrong button. Okay, so I made a walk pathway over the road and moved all of these down a little bit so now what we can do is I can put in a new walking thingy so we're gonna create a new line here to here to here and then we'll just run this back and to there what what like what in the actual freak is happening complete line what the freak well, I don't know what was going on with that, but we completed it, so... Sweet! So now we got a pathway, so that means... These are all... Uh, whoa. Going to pyramid of tourists. They're all tourists! Which means we're bringing in tourism monies! Which should increase the values... Well, it should increase our income anyway. How is our park? Is it leveled up yet? No, it's going to take a while to get it leveled up to the next one. But we are getting there. I mean, we have this whole new, like, area. Do I have any more? I, have more, I do have more buildings I can put in here. So we can go ahead and throw that one in. Uh, what else do we got? Uh, there is the Grand Mall. Because why not? Ooh, an opera house. Sure. Okay. So now that we've added those into this little area here, we can go back in here and actually add stops and add a stop. What the? That's weird. Okay. So we got more stops. So that should increase our tourism. 
So wait, okay, so we can, where's our tourism over here? Tours. So we have four per week on our walking tours for now, but we did just barely put this new walking tour in. So it'll take it a little bit before that gets built up. Uh, we have 44 per week on our bus tours. So this is a very, our touristy area. What? But we can act, what? I don't know what I'm talking about. We can actually extend this out now to there because why not? And then we'll throw in a road up to there. So that should help. Right, okay, so that's looking pretty good. And then we can throw in some more light residential just in there. I guess we could throw some in over here as well. Or residential, commercial. Light commercial. Is there water over here? Well, not for this outer area. There's, well, now there is, kind of. Connect, connect, okay. There we go, so there's water there now. So we've got more space to build touristy things. I'm gonna not block that road though, so I can actually build through there. So we'll throw you in the observatory I want to put on the top of the hill. So, we're gonna put it, I think, up on top of here because there's a way I can actually, might be able to build a road here. So, we're gonna go with no snap two angles and like freeform roads. I think is what I'm gonna go for, just to make this look a little more realistic. Because, I mean, who builds a completely straight road when you're coming down off of a mountain, right? Like, nobody does that. Okay, so we just built that road up to here. And then, do I need to extend? Maybe I need to extend this just a hair. Okay. All right, so now I should be able to build the, obs oh God, that's bigger than I thought it was. Observatory. It needs electricity, but we can run that up from right there. Boop. Wow, that's actually not very far away from that. <laughs> and then some water, which we can run up right there. Okay. So now it has water and electricity. Good, 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 good. Then I'm thinking we could actually build a hiking path, which would be fun, I think. Maybe. I'm going to do it. And we'll see how it turns out. So we'll leave it paved from here to here. Uh, maybe. Okay, we'll leave it paved up to there. And then this is going to be where the pathway starts to climb up the mountain. That's a really steep hiking path. We'll just connect it up right there. All right, so now, um, I feel like I should level that out a little bit, maybe? Okay, well, that's not working quite like I was hoping it would, but, I mean, it is a hiking path, hiking trail that we can use to get up there, so I think that means I also need to put in a walking tour, create a new, actually, we'll go create a new line, it's gonna follow this path up to the observatory and back. Okay, so there's a hiking trail, which I think is looking pretty good, other than it's very slow, slanted, whatever you wanna call it. But hopefully people will use that. And then, I mean, I guess we could put in some more hiking trails over here. Like we don't have a lot of hiking stuff. Let's throw in another trail. We'll just do kind of a dirt hiking trail, I guess, that goes from there. And then, ooh. whoa. Bloop, like that. Wait, 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 I, want, I wanted that bridge. That bridge was cool. I want to put in a bridge. That's kind of cool. I don't know what I'm making them hike to, but something. I don't know. I don't know. I really, I don't know. I just wanted to build it, so I built it. All right, can I name the lines? That's what I want to know now. Oh, here we go, walking tour one, two, okay. So walking tour four, mountain road trail. This one is observatory trail, walking tour two, traction row. All right, so we've got all of those. 
Let's do Observatory Trail. Let's make it a blue road trail. We'll just call it road trail for now. We'll make it yellow. Traction row, we can leave that as green. Okay, that looks pretty good then. So we've got us a few hiking trails now. Like, I don't know that anyone's actually gonna take this one to go see the road. I probably should add another attraction or something up here. But people are going up to see the observatory, which is awesome. I thought I saw a couple of people on the hiking trail. Oh yeah, there goes somebody up the hiking trail. So there's a few people that are hiking up the trail. Mm, I might need to move it a little bit closer into town, but we'll have to wait and see on that. So that's all I have time for this video. So guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And as always guys, thank you so much for joining me on this wonderful adventure. And I will see you on the next one. Bye guys.